Hello. Hey, Minxie ladies. Can you be my design team? I really need your help. If you are a fan of the Willet boot, remembering this is the Willet boot here with the little internal lift in it uh, and our little signature uh, sporty sole. If you're a fan of this, I really need your help on new materials for, um, for next season, summer injection and or winter production. So I've got some beautiful, new, exciting uh, leathers uh, just sent to me now from China. And I just wanted to know what you think. So it's really important that if you're watching this and you've got an opinion that you just let me know because I just want to, um, yeah, I'd love to be able to design the shoes that you want. Uh, this is a new, um, a new floral leather. It's got like a slight mesh um, print over the top of the uh, over the top of the flowers. Uh, it's kind of navy combined with black, a little hint um, of a white in there as well. And was just thinking, I don't know if you if that helps you visualise that. If I put that back with the white sole, um, doing this little version here with the white sole, um, oh, I could maybe show you a little bit better. Um, yeah, do you like that? So ladies that wear this Willet boot, would you like to see this little flower? Um, and I'm thinking the white sole, but I also might actually sample it with the black sole as well. Looks quite good with the black sole. Uh, so I feel like I'm okay with this. I like this, um, I like this leather. I think it's quite unique and um, give you something quite bespoke in this space, considering everyone's jolly well copied us. Uh, the other one, which I think is a bit fringy uh, but I'm quite excited about it's a beautiful um, it's a beautiful leather um, it has a I don't know if you can see through the screen but it has like um, quite a shimmery sort of effect on it and it's that sort of leopardy type print uh, so you've got that kind of burnt orange black a whitish type base gray white with the sparkle over it so I was thinking maybe we put that into the Willet boot as well a little silver silver um, zipper on it and the white sole uh, what Bridget do you think, and Vic ladies? love the blue. Okay, cool. Do you have, uh, Bridget and Vic, do you have a preference of sole? Do you prefer the white sole or the black sole or can't decide? Um, so back that, to the leopard. Uh, back to the leopard. Uh, okay, so, so what, do you ladies like? Do you the leopard? like the leopard print? Is this something you'd wear, or it's a bit like over the top, a little bit too adventurous, or too hard to visualize? Maybe like that's it, kind of put up onto the toe area there. Could you imagine wearing that with your jeans um, or what have you? Okay, I'm going to show you some other materials. If we, if we don't get any comments on it, we probably won't run it because um, it's all about you guys. Uh, now, I've got this graffiti print leather, which is quite fun. Um, but again, you have to imagine it on, a, on mass in a boot. So that's kind of a white base with a black squirrely kind of graffiti prints on it. <coughs> Excuse me. So... Can you imagine that over the toe? Kind of similar to a graffiti um, daisy flower we did a couple of, maybe three or four years ago now. Um, so yeah, are you ready for another, another something like that? And again, I feel like it's not as contrasting the pattern or design uh, unless it's against the black sole. So I don't know, what are you thinking there, ladies? Um, love both the blue and the leopard, both with the white sole. Okay, yep, great, great. Michelle and Vic say white sole for the blue. blue the blue here, awesome, thank you ladies. Um, black, more grungy, grungy but like both. Yeah, yeah, they're very I don't do colors. leopard, but many of my friends do. Okay. The black and white graffiti is very funky. Yeah, but would you wear it? Like, is it too edgy? Is it too much? Is it too full on? Would you feel like, oh, I don't know if I can get away with that? I mean, it is quite cool. Um, and we, I can design it into um, more sort of grungier, heavy sort of winter boots for next winter. Um, okay, then I've got, because I know you ladies have been asking for metallic. And so we've got like a couple of subtle metallics here in... Um, this is, I don't know if you can see on screen very well, but this is more of a rose gold metallic with a black spot. Um, and this is more of a gold-based beige. Uh, actually, you can probably tell from the backs of the leathers there. So more pinky-based um, rose in here and more gold-based um, beige in through here. So um, would you like to see an all-over spotty boot like that in metallic or it's all a bit too much? Um, or do you just like the leather and would like to see it in something else? Um, so yeah, that's a couple of little spotty options. I do have this here, which is like a um, 
it's more of a black based silver white spot um is that something you prefer okay um, so renee came in not this renee here came in a bit late but i like the leopard oh yeah oh cool thanks um, renee karen says love the gold slash beige spots Spot. material yeah. yeah 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 do you prefer that with a white sole do you think it'll look kind of a little bit more kind of fun and sporty with a white sole or do you think it does need that contrasty sort of black black sole on it um michelle says yeah, love the white. metallic leather no spots oh yeah okay actually uh no could upstairs. you run upstairs sitting on my desk yeah. I, I think can... there are there's a couple of metallic suede actually they're metallic suede we'll show you ladies it's really good feedback because it's exactly what we've been thinking Vic says all over spotty beige it's all over spotty beige okay um and the silver spot with the white sole is, sole is gorge okay that's back to this here looking at that karen likes the white sole with her beige gold spot yeah thanks karen okay that's looking at that okay that's really good feedback so that kind of eliminates that which is kind of cool um okay what else can i show you i also we got this leather through here which is really really beautiful it's um really pretty feminine sort of sorbet i'm going to call them sorbet type shades they've got minties a bit of lemon in here pink peach watermelon lilacs yes. oh yeah okay yes. okay 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 so i'm just gonna um they's just gone and got these so i think ladies this is um do, uh, so here's my question then here's a good question for you um i've just got something to read to you first okay, go, go <laughs> before i get ahead of myself here spots could be awesome with white sole and bandits yes yes yeah, we were thinking about bandits too we should have actually we should have actually actually we've got those here um, ladies chris says black well? sole with beige spot okay um susie says white sport white sole <laughs> white sole is more sporty yeah it is more sporty. That's kind of um, with regard to the bandit sneaker. Can you kind of visualize? It would be quite cute, you know. Yeah. I think really it would be really cute. That's a really, you'd wear that name? Yeah. I might get you to just. Yeah. Karen yeah. says uh, the beige yeah. spots could be awesome in summer sandals as well. Yeah, I have produced some already, but I think it's, it could be quite a good injection um, to do that in a sandal. Yeah, I can imagine that being quite cute. Uh, so I just wanted to show you this. These are um, some of the new suede metallics that we're working with at the moment. And we're actually we're working more with the Pretty Polly. So I'll get Nay to stick her foot in camera. Um, so, so we were actually thinking of Pretty Polly in um, this kind of uh, look here. So perforating all of this panel here in this colour. And then making these solid panels just solid with that material. Um, and then I had a bit of a sand sort of colour to just to put in the back there to break up all of that uh, rosy gold or actually I've called it I've called it peach rose gold uh, and then that's more your silver kind of tone there I don't know if you ladies can see that very well in the light there thanks now so we're thinking of definitely doing that in the pretty poly situation uh, but I don't see why we couldn't do it down here but is it too pretty girly and girly like that does it need a spot Sonia says OMG, yes, gold. Gold. Vic says bandit in spots, yes. Yeah. Carol says love the bandit. Yeah. Michelle says love the suede metallics, peach ro rose, rose gold. gold, yum. Oh, fantastic. Um, so, okay, here's a question for you ladies. If you had to choose between uh, doing, say, the Willet in, a, in just this um, plane or the spot, what would you pick would you would you want to go for the all over spot or would you just want to have like a beautiful sort of soft metallic all over or do you think the panels need to be broken up a bit um sonia gold which is gold one maybe or is it that uh, the one? peach i don't know this is we're calling this a peach, peach. gold we're calling it what do i call it peach rose metallic Michelle says plain will it please. Okay. Okay, Michelle, what when you say okay. plain will it, do you, you mean, mean you she means these plain or plain oh those You mean plain. plain like this. Um and the mm. peach rose and the taupe metallic I call that. Carol soft metallic metallic all over. Okay. Vic all over spot. Okay. Tracy spot with a black sole in the willet. Okay. Sonia peach gold. 
Yeah. Chris Willett, Spot, Black Spot. Yeah, uh, uh, Black Soul. Was that Black Soul Spot? Mm. Uh, yeah, probably. Yeah. Carol says peach gold all over. Bridget yeah. says plain peach. Yep. Karen says could do plain metallic with spots on the back panel. Yes. Yeah, it's finding... The challenge is finding materials that go together see how they're slightly off tone i don't know if you can see that on camera and when you actually make that into a shoe it becomes quite glaringly obvious that they don't match which is a bit of a challenge when you have these uniquely printed colors what um, do I do for the other one? um leanne says spot with black sole oh, that was that one, yeah. michelle says love both plain metallics white sole and will it bridget or mix peach and silver yeah you could do a mixture of the two we're definitely going to do the pretty poly and a mixture of the two the two different yeah. panels um oh you girls are amazing okay that's good so okay that's made up my mind there what we'll probably do is we'll do uh both versions of this uh so we'll do the peach metallic and we'll do the taut metallic we'll put white soles on those and then you overwhelmingly preferred this um, this more gold-based spot. What color is the spot on the left? This one here. Or was it this one? Oh, was it that one? Okay, well, that's another. this is another spot option here, which is, um, it's actually white with a black spot, but over the top surface of this leather, I, can't, I don't know if you can see it, but it's like, it's got an emboss on it that's like a lizard print emboss. So the texture's kind of, um, the texture's kind of split and looks a little, it's quite cool. Um, will it spot all over black sole over the years? Think rose gold is here today, gone tomorrow color, i.e. comes yeah. and goes. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. 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 Okay. Uh, so... So we've got another little pattern for you as well in new leathers. Love the texture spot too. The texture spot I'm taking to be this one here. Yeah, yeah it is quite cute. So we didn't we didn't get much feedback on this. So I say no. Is this a no, ladies? Mm. This is, this is a the, no. Can we can we put that against again? Show the ladies. That's the white, and this is the black. Do we like this? Do we not like this? Like we can't do everything. Are we yeah. better to do this the this here instead? Mm. Um, the black the... and white spot with black soles. Yeah. Yep. Wendy says. Yeah. Right. Nice. No to graffiti. No to graffiti. Okay, that's good. That's good feedback. <laughs> uh, okay, so we've got here a new another new leather. Um, it's kind of, to me, uh, looks a little bit like a hand-drawn tiny feather, like a little tiny quail feather or something cute like that. It's embossed, so um, the base colour on this is the metallic, and then it's got a wipe over it. So this is like almost like um, sort of a mustardy yellow uh, over the top there, and underneath that emboss coming through is gold. Uh, and this is like the same thing, um, it's almost like a whitewash. Um, so that's the silver with the whitewash. This here is um, like a bronze shade with like a almost a coppery sort of uh, tone to it. I don't know if you can see that very well. Um, do you like these leathers? Or are they a bit sort of too full on? Okay, no one likes the graffiti. No one. Okay, and thank you. Michelle Amazing. says she loves the mustard in this feathery oh. print. Print here. Yeah. What, could you stand and all over? I think it's probably full on, too full on for a willet boot all um, over. Lisa says love the bronze, which is also yeah. the... This oh, is here. That's the bronze. Love yeah. the bronze, Nicola. Yeah. Um, Chris says wedding cake icing, not ready for the trendy willet. Yeah. Okay. I agree. I agree with that. Wedding cake icing. That, it does look like wedding cake uh, yeah. icing. That is such a good definition. I love these descriptive words. Um, okay. Um, Tracy, love the copper. Yeah. Vic, love the bronze. Karen, love the bronze. Kim, yeah. love the bronze. Oh, wow. Christy, cool. love the bronze. Beautiful. Carol, okay. whitewash. Michelle, oh. ooh, love all the feather print. How to choose. Okay. Uh, Kim, I we think the do... graffiti would be cool in a sneaker. Carolyn, yeah. love the bronze. So we could do, ladies, maybe the wedding icing on the white sole, do you think? And we could do um, the bronze on the black sole. So it's just a little bit more tonal. I think when you put it with a white sole, it all of a sudden looks a bit, 
sort of bright or something. It looks a bit off. So we could do that. Um, yeah. Love the bronze on the front only. On the front only. I don't. What mm -hmm. would you do in the back then? Um, bronze with black sole. Bronze, yes, yes, Tracy. Okay. So, wow. Oh, that's cool. That's quite. That's quite cool. Uh, okay. Next question. Next question. Uh, what did we? What did we think? Did we just look up my skirt then by accident? <laughs> No, good. okay. Oh, good. Sorry, ladies. Um, flash mob. No, uh, this, this here was the other color we were talking about. Um, so just to kind of describe it, all those sorbet tones, um, and over the top of that is a bit of a patent kind of embossing shimmer. Just keep reading out if you've got comments here, Lise. Um, Nicola says definitely bronze with black sole. Lisa, okay. bronze and black for sure. Yeah. Michelle, call it get me to church. <laughs> Oh, you get me to church on time, maybe? <laughs> oh, she said, oh, my gosh. She Is anyone said, getting married? Would they wear this to a wedding? It could yeah. be your art prey um, wedding. Oh. That would be so fun. Oh, my God. Uh, you ladies are hilarious. I love it. Vic says, love the colours. Bridget, love, love. Yes, love the sorbet. Could we do, like, would anyone think these look like clown shoes if that was all over sorbet? Like, totally see it down here. And, like, your little bandit sneaker, how beautiful. Because it's also what you can't see is this leather is like so soft it's like a sheep napper it's so gorgeous um so we could do like a fun little bandit sneaker we could even you know how pretty would it be back with your pearl oops how pretty would it be back with your uh pearls perla be kind of cute um so yeah i don't know if it's look at the ladies are singing the barbie song are they um <laughs> and karen yeah, says nicer in the barbie. bandit vic yeah. says bandit with sorbet yeah okay mm -hmm. okay let's do that the, the ladies have spoken uh right do we have any more questions um what did we think about this pattern i don't think we showed the ladies this pattern yet did we which one? Oh yeah we didn't we did start with that one. Oh, ladies we didn't get your feedback on this one here yeah do you like this it looks like a little lace cut out um, situation there. I'll just try and make it look like a panel to help you visualize. Um, would that be too full on for you? Um, that I could see we could leave like a black panel in through the back here um, and then have this kind of these two panels here. So you'd be looking down on that. I don't know how we what are we vibing on that? Is that looking okay? Um, Not keen? They're probably just seeing this now. So oh, yeah. um, Bridget says, no, I'm a color girl. This yeah. is back to the sorbet. Okay. Lisa, maybe not all over sorbet with um, with the bandit, bandit. I'm assuming. Yeah. But ooh, Perla. Yeah. Tracy, kind of arty, but okay as a pop of color. Love yeah. the sorbet with pearls, says Kim. Yeah. Michelle says this is too busy for her. She loves the metallics. Okay, good. Kim says, I don't That's like it. the lace. Okay, good. What are we to know? Yes, eh? on the black and white sole. Don't like the lace. Okay. Cute. Panel, definitely not all over. No to the lace. Okay, let's get rid of the lace, ladies. The ladies have spoken. <laughs> We're going to get rid of the lace. Okay, so I guess to recap, uh, we, we're going to look at um, your plain metallics, 100% back with a white sole. We're going to do that, 100%. Uh, then we're going to do your uh, white texture with a black sole, 100%. Are we, is this what we're Is we this mean? 100% ladies? Is this what we decided? I think we, I think <laughs> I think this is what we decided. I think, I think so. what we decided. I think so. uh, and we, were, we talked also about the leopard, or if we've gone off the leopard now, we've seen all the other options. I think the leopard's cool. I think the no, leopard would sell. Cool. It's got a shimmer on we it. We didn't get much feedback on the leopard. Yeah, I, th I like the leopard. The leopard is... Um, it's got like a shimmer on the surface. It's really, really soft. It's also got like a bit of an emboss over the surface of it. You probably can't see, but it's quite interesting. It's quite an interesting texture. We're getting lots of um, 100%. Oh, good, 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 good. Michelle uh, said, ooh. Gonna... Ooh. Oh, Michelle. <laughs> oh, ooh to, the, ooh to the leopard. Is it ooh to the so. leopard? Michelle, is it ooh to the leopard? Yes, to the leopard. Leopard is cute. Yes, yes, leopard. Okay, okay, good, good, good. Uh, so the bronze, you quite like the bronze, but I think it needs to go back with the black sole, ladies, because it's, I think it's just going to look a bit offbeat with the white sole, mm. a bit too contrasty uh, and unusual. So that I'm going to do that there. 
we have to do this. I, I mean, just adore this. I think you ladies are going to love it. It's very, very playful, and we all need something that brings us a bit of joy and happiness and makes us smile. So that's a bit of a go, burgers. Um, what did we decide with? Oh, yeah, and we also. Did, did we still like this? Did, were you going to put it on the bandit or not? Uh, what yeah, happened what to the say? top with black saw? Top. Top. What top. Is it? What uh, what top? Is it, is it that the lighter other version of that? The is it this? Maybe. We didn't talk about putting these on a black soul though. Um. Uh, not a leopard. Nice to see white leopard with brown combo. Michelle meant to say yeah. meow, not ew. <laughs> um, <laughs> Thanks, Michelle. Oh Le my gosh, I love you ladies. <laughs> Lisa said like leopard. Uh, love the navy daisy. Sorry, cool. I mean top spot. Oh, yeah. this one. This, oh, the, this, this spot here? Mm. Leopard could be cool on Perla Bandit. Yes. Yes, yes to the gorgeous blue flower and yes to the black spot. And yes. Actually, so, actually, we did have... Yes, um, yes to the blue flower, black spot. Yeah. And beige gold. That's the bit, that. Yeah, I think Vic has been taking notes. Okay. <laughs> no, I think um, this one, this one, we've got, and we've got this one here. We've got this here. We've got that there. Oh, my legs are gone. <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh, oh, no, oh. white soul, please. White soul. Ooh, I lo lost my place here. Winter. Gold spots on bandit. White soul, please. Lo uh, OMG, can see my Manx shoe collection will be growing. <laughs> Gosh, we are demanding a lot. No, no, it's not. It's not. It's not. We love it. We love it. Oh, that it's gold. Sorry. Light was funny. Oh, oh okay. Which yeah, one's I'm gold? sorry. Lady, uh, yeah, one? see, that looks gold that in your, when I look down at your camera. It's actually, this is the, member that's the peachy one. The peach um, rose metallic, um, but it does look very gold in the camera. Um, that's your to help you visualize. That's the beautiful bandit bandit sneaker with that. Oh, yeah. It's gonna look good. Mm -hmm. I think it's gonna look really good. God, yeah. you guys are really good at designing. So we're gonna do in the bandit 100% the leopard because I think it's beautiful. Um, I think what we'll do with this is I'll put this contrast white because I uh, someone commented there's all a bit too much all of the sorbet all in one lot. But I think once we put um, actually those laces, you know the grow grain laces. They're over uh, there. Where are they? Just yeah, there's a white grow grain lace. We'll show the lady. So what I would do is I would frame this material with the white sole the white binding around here, and then a beautiful little grow grain soft lace. Is that kind of coming together when you look at that, ladies? How are we feeling about that? I think that's gonna look quite cute. Love the sorbet and white together. Yes, yes, bandit and leopard, it's delish. The yeah. bandit and leopard is so effing cool. <laughs> <laughs> Tracy, does leopard go with the peach gold as insert? Uh, Oh yeah, yeah, it is. It is. It is. Just it is. Actually, yeah. Nay was just. She's just going to show you what we mean. So, um, this is kind of what I was thinking in through here because you ladies loved all of this here. You went crazy for it. We just run it as a limited edition print. So yeah, that's that's it helps you to kind of visualize that pretty little, pretty little look there. Um. Okay. Cool. Thanks, Nay. Yes, awesome. sorbet. Yes, leopard bandits. Okay. okay cool. 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 Um. Oh. Gold with black spot, I meant. I'm sorry, I'm confusing everyone. Oops. Oh, no, Tracy said. Gold with a black spot. Yeah. Yeah, that's it there. But, yeah, I don't think we made a decision on the spotties. Yeah, we're going to make a decision. Um, I don't know whether we do that one. It's that one that we're not going to do, mm. eh? Oh. But then what soul are we going to have? I think Should it... Should we put them, put them on the... On the white soul, maybe. White soul to show. Yeah. Okay, ladies, one, two, or three. What's your vote? One, two, or three. If you were going to have this, like, uh, for your Willet boot, so imagine it's going to be all over. It's going to be quite full on. One, two, or three. Silver, white spot needs white sole. Yeah. Two, Agreed. three. <laughs> That's two, one. Two, or two. Ooh. Two and three. Two and three. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm, yes, I'm happy with Yes, gold, black that. spot, and black spot. 
Okay. Yeah, I think yeah. two and okay. three. Okay, that's cool. I three. do like this leather. Don't worry, ladies. We may end up using it back down in here and like more simple panelling. Um, it could be quite cute. So we'll have a play with it. Don't fret. This might not be out forever. Um, okay, that's good. Oh my gosh, I just want to say a big massive thank you um, for helping me today or the girls and I today decide what colours we're going to give you your beautiful new Willets in. Was well, there anything else we um, needed to ask while we were here? What's the white and black paint spotter in the background? Oh, this is this. Is that what you mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's got like a patenty sheen on it, but ladies, I'm a bit concerned. Can you see there's like a dirty sort of like cream kind of tone coming through? And I think that's from the patent. Something's discoloring. It worries me that with manufacturing that that might even get more dirty and more, um, uh, yeah, yeah, kind of funny looking. Like, I don't know whether a retailer would look at that and go, oh, that's a mistake and mm -hmm. send it back. Um yeah, so that's why I kind of put that out to one side. Um, I will show you these. These are really funny. Can you tell me what animal that is? <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I'll turn it around. It might make, I don't know whether you can see the animal in that. It's like spot the animal. Long legs, long neck, probably a pink color I'm imagining. <laughs> Um, but oh, we've got some votes for one now. We might have to tally that up. Oh yeah. gosh, really? We'll tally it up. Okay, we'll yeah. tally it up. That was one. That was one there. Um, not loving that. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. It's yeah. Vic likes. Oh no, we're all guessing that it's a flamingo. <laughs> oh, you're amazing, ladies. You're so onto it. So so um, clever. The beakless flamingo. Do they the beak. Yes, yeah, that's what's missing on the picture. Yeah. Oh yeah. There's no beak. Uh, so, ladies, Renee just said to me, "Do the ladies know, know when we Yeah, <laughs> do the ladies know when uh, what what we're talking about here? So, we are forward projecting for you at the moment. Um, so, these may be uh, late summer injections uh, and early next winter um, designs. Um, certainly, these ones here, the lighter ones, we could probably get in um, a little bit earlier. So, Maybe the um, too. And the leopard, yeah, the, the, I'd say these ones here, we might have a fiddle. Even these metallics, we could do a bit earlier. Mm -hmm. um, and maybe, that's quite light as well, isn't it? So maybe these ones here, we'll have a play with getting them in earlier for you, ladies. Those on the floor is winner, winner, chicken dinner. <laughs> awesome. Oh, actually, you know what? Lisa and I were a bit nervous kind of reaching out to everyone um, uh, just to get, get feedback because... Um, Yes, so we know some ladies really love the Willet boot. Some ladies have moved on from it. So it's quite nice to know that you ladies that are passionate about this boot want to see it carry on and want to see some new colours in it and materials in it. So uh, a big thank you. A big, super big thank you. Alrighty, um, we are going to check in on this feedback again tomorrow and make some major decisions to send to uh, China for production. So a big shout out, big thank you. And... Um,